my name is Dr. James Fox, and I've been in private practice now for about six months after uh, spending five years at the Medical University of South Carolina uh, with Dr. Mark George and his team there. Uh, I had the opportunity to uh, train and learn on all the major TMS devices, and when I went out into private practice, I knew that the MagVenture was the device I wanted to use. And then when I found out that MagVenture had the 360 patient management system, I immediately knew that that's an add-on that I wanted to have with my system. Uh, I wanted it for two main reasons. One, going out into private practice. I knew that I wanted to ensure that the patients were getting the proper treatment uh, and they were getting uh, the treatment as safely as possible. So the patient management system saves each patient's individual information and their treatment information, and you can tailor it so I can easily give that information to the staff in my clinic and they can deliver uh, the exact treatment that uh, the patient's supposed to have. And then secondly, from a efficiency and documentation standpoint, uh, it makes it really easy to track the treatments for every patient, and uh, there isn't an additional step necessary to record each of the treatments that the patients get. And when, um, you know, whoever gives the treatment, uh, they log into the system, and so it automatically records uh, who gives the treatment and what the parameters are. Uh, it's real nice to be able to set up the entire treatment for a patient at the outset, including the motor threshold and clinical assessment frequency. And so as the patient progresses through treatment, you get nice subtle reminders uh, through the course of treatment that a motor thresholds do or a clinical assessments do. Uh, so you don't miss out on those opportunities uh, to track their progress or to perform the motor threshold for reimbursement purposes. The progress for the patients laid out in a graph that the patients have viewed and they're able to uh, see their own progress. So at times when people are halfway through their treatment, they struggle with whether or not they're getting better. And oftentimes having that visual representation of how they're improving uh, gives them the satisfaction and uh, knowledge that they are getting better and that they'll continue to get better.